Hey guys, Ricardo here and welcome to another Blog Tech Tips. As you just saw a while ago, that was just an example of the issue. And as you saw, it was a problem with your iPhone. In my case, it was the iPhone um, 11. And the issue in question involves where you connect your device to the computer via the lightning cable. So if you connect the lightning cable to a PC, you do get that error where it says a device at attached to the system is not functioning. So if you're seeing a device attached to the system is not functioning, this tutorial, just like in my case, will show you how to fix that problem 100%. So in my case, I was transferring a video from my um, iPhone 11 scene here. And what I was doing was placing it onto my PC so I could um, have that video. But for some reason, every time I was getting the um, error a device attached to the system is not functioning so I want to try the following and these are multiple tips one is guaranteed to work for you and of course you can leave your comments below so let's get straight into the fix now the first thing I want you to try in case you're having this problem is to just go ahead and reboot your phone so of course just unlock your phone and just go ahead and turn the device off and the slide turn off um, in case you do not know it's power and volume up slide and power off i'm not going to do this right now i'm just actually just telling you what to do and for your pc just go ahead as you can see over here this is my pc and just turn off your pc or just reboot start back up and then connect the cable once again um in my case it temporarily solved the issue i was able to transfer one file but after that it started up again so my advice to you is even if it works after this make sure you at least try two files before confirming it's fixed now of course uh, i had to try something else now the second thing that worked for me and this is the one that solved my issue 100 percent and i'm going to show you to do this and i had to do this from my device what i had to do was just go ahead and as you can see let me just unlock all right so my device is now unlocked and you just follow along on your device as well all right, so you're just gonna go into your device and just go into settings. So launch settings. Once you're in settings, go to photos as seen here. So just scroll down. You're gonna look for the option that says um, photos. In other words, it's basically the photo app. Search and you can see it right there, photo. So just stop photo. Once you're in um, photo, go down all the way to the bottom. You should see an option here that says transfer to Mac or PC. Now, of course, it was on automatic by default. So change it from automatic as seen here. So let's do it just like mine shown on screen. So switch to keep originals. So in case you're doubting what I'm saying, just it's on um, automatic. When you go into yours, switch it over to keep originals. That's where the tick is now. After doing this, guys, what's going to happen is it should fix the problem some in some cases you might need to reboot your phone um, it should just work right off the bat so in case just go ahead and connect back up your um, lightning cable once more and connect it to your pc and then try to transfer the file over and of course in 90 percent of the cases this should fix the issue the file should transfer over and every time you try to transfer a file they should transfer over and of course in some cases you might just need to do a quick reboot and try again with the settings change and that should work for you and of course just in case as well there's um a few other tips that you can actually try so that's two tips i've given you already i'm going to give you an additional um three to four for those with um the issues still all right so let me exit this um for those who are on um the windows pc because this is error happens with just windows pc based on my knowledge um, you'll see here we have some ports now these ports at this side here are USB 2.0 ports if you have a blue USB 3.0 port it might be on the other side just go ahead I can show you that right now um, due to the position of this laptop but let's go ahead and switch ports so if you're using port 1 go ahead and switch to port 2 sometimes the issue is with one port so by switching over to port 2 you should have a better results and the file should transfer and again, guys, if it's a USB 3.0 port, I recommend that you use that port. Or if you have some other port on your PC, go ahead and use that. Um, for example, you might have a um, USB-C cable to Lightning where you can just go ahead and connect it to the Lightning, the um, USB-C port. That should work as well if you have that special cable. 
and let's go ahead and try that next next check your um, data cable let me move this out of the way so in my case you can see here um, this is the original lightning cable make sure you're using the lightning cable that came with your phone or of course an apple certified one uh, sometimes the cable is at fault fault so i advise that you switch to a new cable or just use the original one that came with your device sometimes cheap cables can be the problem they can damage your phone as well so i do not advise you use those and they cause all kind of um um, problems so make sure that you switch out your cable to original cable even good cables can also go bad so watch out for cables with flaws such as um, shorts or any damage to the cabling next guys make sure you go ahead and update your drivers as you see here we have iTunes iTunes allow uh, the device to communicate with your iPhone make sure you're on the latest version of iTunes so check for updates and install the latest drivers sometimes you can have communication problems if you do not have the latest um, drivers and as you saw right now after launching and checking for updates are automatically it shows me there's a new version so it's best to just go ahead and download the new versions of iTunes to make sure you're on the latest version when you're on the latest version you might find that it connects better with the latest version so go ahead and update the latest version of iTunes updates also include um, stuff like QuickTime player make sure you have all of those updates everything related to your phone next um, in case you have tried all of that and nothing works another of my advice is to just go ahead and switch computers sometimes the computer itself might be at fault it might be a faulty laptop so go ahead and switch over to another computer you might find that the other computer works way better and you don't have the same issue and you're able to transfer and the issue might be the computer itself also if you're on a desktop do not use the ports at the front use the ports at the back they are way more reliable and of course watch out for the files you're transferring sometimes it's a very large file and that might be the issue itself so try to transfer with smaller images and smaller files all right guys so that's about it and of course as i said the second tip was the one that fixed it for me and i'm no longer receiving device attached to the system is not functioning um in most cases the problem is caused by that setting that i showed you on the photos if you change that everything should be okay and also just in case as a final tip make sure as well that on the settings photos or settings and photos make sure that all your settings match my settings so let me just scroll through because who knows somebody might have gone in before and changed or modified some settings so something else might be showing off um, the um, settings so let me show you from the top and let me start back over so let's go to settings once you're in settings, as I said before, go to photos and make sure at the top here, everything is the same. Notice I, um, my settings are here. iCloud is on. Optimize iPhone storage. Notice that that's checked. All of these boxes are checked. And of course, keep originals is checked, which is the main setting that causes the issue. So make sure everything is as shown here. All right, guys, I won't drag on this video any longer. I've tried to go through this problem thoroughly as it's very annoying when you cannot transfer your files especially important video files to back them up or for whatever reasons in my case i was trying to get a video i wanted to convert which was not transferring over all right guys so this wraps up this tutorial it's ricardo ghana for blog tech tips as usual if any question ask them below it's ricardo ghana saying bye until next time guys bye and love you